Hey everyone, taking a quick look at the SC6000 Prime by Dead and DJ, of course. And a little trick I want to show you guys. So this is for drum and bass. It probably applies to some other genres, but this works very well for drum and bass. One of the first things you're going to have to do is if your drum and bass is at like 86, which is, I think, is the normal way that you should be analyzing your stuff, but that is up for debate between people. But if you press and hold, and very quickly, see what it says? Times two. Times two. There we go, 172, right? Now, play the track. Hop on your rolls. Engage your slip mode. Have your start stop time right around 11 o'clock. And check this out. Catch that? So that's it. Um, takes a little bit of finesse to just kind of your, what you're doing. Let's show you again real quick. Turn on the volume so you see what's happening here. You're, you're holding that down while you engage it, and then you can almost hit them both again to get out of it. So that's it. That's my trick on the Denon DJ SC6000. Hopefully that uh, little tip and trick was helpful for you drum and bass heads out there.